how to use PandaBuy. Hi guys, welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can use PandaBuy. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. So first things first, what you're gonna do is you're gonna come over to their website, pandabuy.com. Now once you're over here, you're just simply gonna go ahead and sign up. Now the sign up process is very simple. All right, let me show you. So this is the sign up process. You just simply select your country, your username, your email, your password, you confirm your password, you enter in the verification code, which is right here, and then you just simply confirm the email, basically verify the email that was sent to your email or address right here, as you can see. This is the email that they sent, I verified it, and my account has been created, and I'm done. So I'm just simply gonna go ahead and log in. And we are now logged in and we are good to go. So if you don't know what Panda Buy is, it's basically as the name suggests right here, their tagline, shop from China, shop with Panda Buy. So you can over here, you can go ahead and purchase your orders. You can ship them to the warehouse. You can check the quality and then you can globally ship them. So pretty straightforward, nothing to you know complicated although it does take a little bit of time like you purchase the order uh, about a week later they arrive at your warehouse at the panda buy warehouse where you will also be able to check the quality and once it's done once it's approved you will be able to ship it to your home using the provider of your choice right so very simple now how do you get products so very simple you just simply select or enter in the product link or name or shops link or PI or image and just simply click on search. You also have the select option over here. You can select for a specific product or shop as well. There's also this beginner guide if you want to learn about more from it. You know, you can go ahead and check it out. There's also the help center and there's also the estimation as well. So what is the estimation over here? It will basically give you an estimation on how long it would take and how much it would cost you, right? And you just enter in the destination warehouse, uh, the weight, the length, width, height, and the mail restrictions over here. As you can see, uh, clothing, accessory, luggage, belt, whatever then you just simply inquire and in you will have your shipping fee estimation so basically a calculator it's pretty cool so let's go ahead and fill it out so destination we'll just select uh we'll select us and over here the type of clothing we'll go with actually watches or actually clothing accessories and we'll choose common brand there we go and then we enter in the weight so don't know what the weight is in grams so it's around leather jacket weighs around three to four pounds. So three pounds is equal to 1360 grams. We'll just equal it out, put it right here and we'll just say 1361 now length. Okay, so this is it. I don't really know if the measurements are, might be off. I am not really sure, but let's go ahead and click on inquire to see if it works. Okay, so I just entered in a, you know, a small box right here length width height whatever maybe if we go with 100 see this is what i mean uh we can't have that because it's too high because i keep getting the measurements wrong so that's why it doesn't work but right here if i go ahead and like put a smaller measurement we get our fees right here so ems is gonna charge us three this rate right here four to 28 days right uh transit is going to be four to 25 days Quizo one this is the warehouse location uh, 31 dollars 400 dollars we have others as well but they have specifications that we do not meet that's why we cannot you know select them but yeah generally speaking once you have them you are good to go maybe if we go to a second warehouse let's see what happens there now and also maybe we change the destination from usa to maybe germany whatever and we'll click on inquire and as you can see we get different rates as well so it actually is really helpful and it actually works as well now let's go ahead and find us some products so to find products i'm going to come over here onto reddit and this is the fashion reps this is a uh you could say a subreddit for fashion and clothing so what i'm going to do now is i'm going to select this one or this image right here maybe we can find it right here as you can see if i open the image up in another tab and save the image 
now we just simply select the image right here this was the image then we'll click on search see if we can find this image or a product similar to this image if not i have another one we can test that out as well all right so it did register or gave me a few options right here but none of them match but it is what it is let's try another option as well let's upload this jacket right here and see what happens if it doesn't find anything good i could always go to aliexpress and find a product from there as well and here we go okay so now it's giving me a proper uh you know options right here much much more similar to the one that i have put up and as you can see these all look really good and really nice and we could actually go with now all that's left for us to do is to just simply select the product that we want so this one looks really cool so we'll just simply click on that product right there now what we need to do is we need to go ahead and buy the product so to buy the product uh okay it's is around 58 dollars right so to buy the product what we need to do is we need to select the size we'll go with a large size and with this black color and now we agree to their terms and services and we click on add to cart and now it's been added to the cart i believe yeah, here we go now we just simply click over here on our little icon and maybe we click on to orders here we go we have our cart option right here this is it so we have two options let me remove that there we go now all that's left for us to do is to just simply select it all right and over here we have the estimator as well we can estimate how much it's going to cost us and we can also submit so we click on submit all right confirm now all that's left for us to do is to agree to their terms and services all right and click or enter in the destination if we want to let's go ahead and select usa there we go we click on submit order now all that's left for us to do is to you know pay up so we have a top up option where we pay with the yen option right here we can enter in our card and you know pay right here or use paypal or use our credit card alipay or stripe or union or any other one we want and confirm payment and once the print payment has been done the product will be shipped to our warehouse and from here we can see our product over here in the warehouse and we can go ahead and then select that product and send it to our location and only if all the quality checks out so it's really simple it is a little bit hectic but i think it's worth it so this is how you use panda buy and this is how you use it to order stuff now of course i'm not going to go ahead and buy this jacket i mean it does look pretty cool but it's you know it is 58 dollars, so i don't know but yeah well if i had bought it it would have arrived over here after eight days or so or a week into my warehouse and then i could just ship it to my location and that's it so that's how you use panda buy that's how you use it to buy items from china so that is it for this video guys hope you guys enjoyed this video if you found this video helpful and educational be sure to hit the like button subscribe to the channel and turn on post notifications and i will catch you guys in the next video and until then take care and goodbye